Eating fish is very important for Chinese during Chinese New Year Day. This is a Teochew style steamed fish. So naturally, I will need to have a fish in this recipe. Now, for Chinese New Year, it is very important when we make a fish dish at the family reunion, we need to make sure that the fish that we buy is a whole fish and that we will serve it as a whole fish as well. So the fish itself will need to have a head and needs to have a tail. The fish that I got today is a red snapper. So it has a head and a tail. Now, for the Chinese, the head and the tail is very important um, for the Chinese New Year Day. The reason is that the head is the beginning of something and the tail is the end or to finish up something. So everything itself, when you start something, you always need to have the end of it. Now, the other thing is that traditionally, when you serve the fish, whole fish with the head and the tail, the head itself will need to be placed at the table facing the most important person in the family. And it's in this case, usually it is the father who, or the mother at the table. So the head itself will need to face the elder. And if, if it's with a grandparents, it needs to face the grandfather or the grandmother. And the tradition is that that person or the elder will need to eat the fish first before everybody else get to eat the fish. Now the fish itself I have already washed and cleaned. So what I want to do now is to slice it diagonally. And place some tomato in here. This will actually help lift up the fish a little bit. And some mushrooms underneath. Now with the slices of ginger, I'm going to stuff it inside the fish here. Then I'm going to place the fish in here. Then I'm going to place the tomato all around it. And the mushrooms. Preserve Chinese mustard stem. I'm going to place some into the uh, cavity of the fish as well. Next, I want to add some of the chili. Then I'm going to add some ginger, more ginger, tofu, 
then I'm gonna add the preserved salted plum. This is gonna give the fish a little bit of sour, sour and salty flavor. Next, I want to do is I'm gonna add I'm gonna add one tablespoon one tablespoon of light soy, about two tablespoon of Chinese cooking wine, one tablespoon of sesame oil. Then I'm gonna add one cup of water. Okay, the water is boiling. So I'm gonna put the fish in. And I'm gonna steam it for 10 minutes. Okay, the fish has been steaming for 10 minutes. So I'm gonna have a quick check. Okay, it's not really cooked yet. I'm gonna add some water. I'm gonna steam it for another three minutes. Okay, that's another three minutes. So a total time of 13 minutes. <clears throat> gonna garnish with some uh, spring onions, some chopped coriander leaves. I'm gonna heat up some oil. Now I'm going to pour some hot oil. Have some garlic. If you like this video, remember to subscribe and share with your friends and family. My name is Victor Ku. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next week on Chinese New Year Day. <laughs> it is salty, it's sour, it, it is a little bit sweet that comes from the tomato and a little bit spicy that comes from the chili. I really hope that you like this recipe, steamed fish, teochew style. Thanks for watching.